Hello Gemini and welcome to your Timeless Love Reading. So I hope you're all doing well now. We've got the nice rose quartz crystals. We're meditating on your deck. And we're going to use two decks as usual for the love readings. The main deck here, which is my miniature deck. And to clarify, we're going to use the Tinseltown Tarot deck for today. Okay, I hope you're all doing well, Geminis. If you could like comment subscribe to my channel hit the little notification bell and you'll be notified when i upload another reading for you guys okay let's find out what's been happening in your love life and relationships gemini we've got one card that's come out straight away and that's the ace of pentacles reversed okay ace of pentacles reversed Okay, we've got some more. The lovers. Okay, so we've got Ace of Pentacles reversed. The lovers. The Two of Cups. Nice. Page of Swords. And the Eight of Rods. Mm. Oh, and this one's just shot out as well. The Four of Cups. Mm, Gemini. Let's have a look. Mm, we've got some news coming in. Could be an offer that you've been waiting for. The King of Pentacles there. Mm. It's to do with the relationship. And there's been some kind of delay here, Gemini. Some kind of a delay in the relationship. Maybe someone's overseas to distance from you. We've got the star card there. Hmm. Someone sees you as their star, perhaps, Gemini. But they're going to be making you an offer. Hmm. Mm. Two of Queen of Cups there under the Two of Cups. So, and this one wanted to come out as well. Two of Swords. You're waiting to give your cup of love to somebody, Gemini. Mm. Someone's about to put down a burden. You've reached. You've done the hard work. The King of Rods. Someone sees something long term with you, Gemini. They see a new beginning with you, maybe. A new start. Mm. That's definitely to do with a relationship. There's news coming in very quickly. We've got the hanged man there. We've got the chariot. So someone's seen something from a different perspective there. And they've decided to make the move. And you've got the seven of rods there. Are they going to be victorious? Mm. Let's go through these cards once we've got the last three cards out for you. Yeah, someone's tired. They've put a lot of effort into something. Maybe a relationship with you, but... Seven of Pentacles, I think this is a long-term relationship. That we're looking at here. And we've got the Five of Cups and the 
got the Hierophant reversed. Someone's got a decision to go against maybe the traditional way. Mm. Sorry about any traffic noise that you can hear in the background there. I have got the window open. It's very hot in the UK at the moment. Mm, Gemini, what has been going on? This is not a bad reading. There's choices to be made here by somebody to do with a relationship, to do with somebody else. Let's have a, clarify, a clarifying card, please, on the Ace of Pentacles, the first card we drew out there. Give me a clarifying card. Mm, we've got the Ten of Pentacles, wow. So we've gone from the Ace of Pentacles being reversed to something not working, um, not instability, basically. You know, this, this, a, a relationship that's not stable. And now we've got the Ten of Pentacles here, which is the happy home life, stability, family wealth, generational wealth. So that's good. But there's a decision here. And there's two people here that are either longing to be together and you're waiting for that person to come back or to make contact with you here or you're not seeing what's being offered. You're disillusioned with this relationship, maybe. But you're not seeing the positive side of what someone is offering here, which is stability. Maybe someone, somebody wants to take your relationship to the next level. I mean, they see you as their star here. And this could be an older guy, but he's got stability. There's his castle in the background. He's offering you stability. And you're facing him, so you want to give him your emotional love, affection. But you've got a choice to make here. Maybe you're not seeing things clearly, or you're not sure. But see, under the Eight of Rods here, we've got to the Ten of Rods, so you've gone past, you've got past the worst of what's, whatever's happening here. The burden is about, is about to be put down here. And then you, this person is going to then become the King of Rods. So they're levelling their game up. And maybe you put yourself out of it, you know, you've taken a step back. Or this person may have taken a step back and now they're going to come forward. But they may have competition. And someone's getting tired here. Maybe tired of waiting around. Maybe you're waiting for someone to take to have a divorce. Maybe you're waiting for someone to leave somebody. I haven't... There's no third party. There is a decision that needs to be made here. But there's no third party that I can see. Yeah, you're single at the moment. There's somebody that's by themselves, but they're very successful. Or well, they're happy by themselves. But they haven't got the love. They haven't got this person here. Mm. You may, have, you may have recently, fairly recently, split from this person or you're having a break. Hence the hangs man there taking time out for re self-reflection on this relationship. And you've been working hard, too hard maybe. Or maybe you've just become a bit disillusioned with the way things are going here. But someone's stepping up. This person here that was offering you the, you know, stability there, 
King of Pentacles. They see you as their star. I think maybe you're single and they're not single at the moment. They, they may be in a long-term relationship, but there isn't. There's a decision that someone's got to make. I'm not seeing any other third-party cards at the moment. Yeah, someone's stuck in their feelings, but there's they're not making a judgment call here. You've got the moon card here and you've got the judgment reversed. Which means either someone's not doing the, the right thing. Or they, they've completely withdrawn and they're, 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 they're stuck in the hanged man position. They're not making the decision or the choice. Mm. Five of Swords withdrawn from the battle. Taking time out again. And this one has jumped out. The Eight of Swords. Yeah, they're pulling their effort into their work, their money. Ignoring the relationship side, maybe. Let's do some clarification with our Tinseltown Tarot deck here. some clarifying cards for you Gemini mm. maybe this person here this could be you but they may not want to leave their home life for their lover here but they've been spying on you looking at your social media maybe and there's news coming in but you're fed up waiting for this offer. You're quite happy by yourself, Gemini, getting on with your work, being successful. Until this person makes the judgment call. And you're just happy, quite happy here working. Whatever you're, you're working on, your money, your coin. But at the end here, the last card is the Hierophant reversed, which is marriage tradition, and this is going against that. Mm. Again, the star card. Twice. Ace of Cups. These are really good cards. Mm. There's success here. Or maybe it's with the person that has either got to make the decision or this is that you're being successful in your own damn right, Gemini. Yeah, strength. Mm. Mind over heart. Maybe you're concentrating on your work. And you're using all your strength to overcome all the feelings here that you've got for this person while they make a decision. Now you're really in your, your element. I mean, this is a nine of cups. Just sit back, relax, doing your own thing, Gemini. You're not making the move here. You're waiting for somebody else to get their crap together and make a choice to come towards you with a better offer. And if they don't, you're going to be on your way. You're not hanging around. And there they are, the Page of Cups, coming in with their surprise, surprising offer, finally. Mm. just as you decide to leave the party they come in with their offer 
Oh, and there you go, two of cups. Finally, you're about to leave. They come in with the surprise of the offer. And there you are, the happy ever after two of cups, the joining of two people. And there we go, justice. So there's going to be justice at the end of this. Also at the bottom of the deck, the High Priestess. So there's going to be justice for you, Gemini. I think you've just got to concentrate on your coin, concentrate on your work, your money, concentrate on you. This is what you're doing here. You're taking time out to reflect. And with the moon as well. You're working hard. Don't get disillusioned because this person, I mean, don't wait for somebody. You know, you just keep doing you, moving on, getting your stuff together. And this person will finally decide, make the choice. You're going to have to be strong when you're doing this, but they're going to make the choice because they see you as their star. And they're going to come in with a surprising offer. You're going to be very happy about it. And justice is done. Wow, that's a nice reading. So I hope you enjoyed your reading, Gemini. As, a, as I said, this is a timeless love reading. So any time you see this will be the right time for you. As I said, like, share, subscribe, comment. I do like to see your comments. I do read them all. And I do reply to them all as well. Um, and thank you to everyone who's subscribed so far. Um, it just encourages me to keep going with, with the readings for you. Uh, take care and always believe in yourself. Follow your dreams. Stay blessed.